mower test drive. Number two, issue with the transaxle still slipping out, but we're going to give it another try and see if she's still going out. So go ahead. Okay, so we got the mower uh, test drove. Issue is still slipping from the transaxle um, from drive or reverse when you're moving. Um, I think it's a belt tension issue since I've already changed the oil in the trans transaxle, made it a little bit thicker. So we're going to get a new belt and see that. But in the meantime, a quick little walk through of the mower. Oh, quick little thing, obviously. doesn't have the and the lid on it right now, but just a quick it's covering snow from the wet year, so real quickly, fun things we did flip this whole support for the front end upside down, we just flipped it and then we welded it across the bottom and then had to move the steering tension connector and had to move that from the bottom of the tire to the top um, in order to keep it aligned. We obviously did a light adjustment to the exhaust so that the tire doesn't hit it when turning. For the things you can see, you had to adjust the throttle a bunch in order to make sure that worked with the foot pedal, which is now installed. The brake here now not only attaches to brake, but it also attaches to the to the tensioner, the belt tensioner, to release tension so you can shift. Um, battery underneath the gas tank, kind of see it there. That's a totally new spot because it was originally under the seat. And since there is uh, no more room under the seat, well, uh, it had to go somewhere else. So you can see here I lowered it quite a bunch. It was originally down here. So I lowered it almost eight inches um, on the rear end here. Um, hydrostatic trans uh, transaxle it's flipped upside down from its original position that also might be causing me issues I have no idea but if you do know please let me know in the comments and I'll uh, get it fixed a different way uh, of course bungee corded on seat just for now we'll start dealing with that once I actually get the drive of the transaxle all figured out and it stops slipping and we'll move on from there and start the fun body work, getting her all cleaned up and ready to go. Painted for some car shows this summer, that's the goal. But there she is, all her glory. She's going to look sweet. So thanks for sticking around. Subscribe down below if you want to check out more. Hopefully we'll see more soon.